world as we know it is changing. As our world changes, so too must technology. The technology I will be talking about is wind turbines. Why are wind turbines important, though? With expanding cities and increasing energy demand, clean energy has become a new priority. But how do we make a wind turbine? What goes into it? At its most basic level, there are three parts. There are the rotor blades that the wind pushes against to move the blades. shaft which connects to the center of the rotor, when the turbines spin, they move gears. The generator uses electromagnetic induction to produce voltage. Wind goes in, energy comes out. However, there are drawbacks. Initial costs for operating wind farms are expensive. Luckily though, wind turbines provide clean, green, renewable energy with little environmental impact. Primary materials that go into making wind turbines are steel, fiberglass, resin, blade core materials, magnets, and copper. After the materials are collected, they are processed into wind turbine parts. Parts are then brought to wind farms where they are assembled. Maintenance on wind farms is also very expensive. The main issue with wind farms, however, is that they can only be placed in very specific areas where the conditions are right. While many people prefer wind energy, because it is more expensive, it remains a very small percentage of energy consumption. Because wind turbines can only be placed in certain areas, Old turbines are generally replaced with newer ones. Old turbines are then cut into pieces and melted down again. 